between London Bridge and Haywards Heath yesterday morning. The latest incident is the sixth attack on passengers travelling on South East trains since the start of the year. Firefighters from the Barbican, a station due for closure, have been praised today for saving the city headquarters of BP. Several hundred people had just started work when fire broke out in a machinery room in the roof. Crews arrived at the building in Broadgate within minutes of flames taking hold. That's it. London weekend tonight is at 6 tomorrow. Do join us then. Bye-bye. Hello again. Well, the weather seems fairly well organised for the London region. Dry by day and a little rain at night. The weather front that produced rain, sleet and snow in the north today is bringing some rain across the south and east now. Much of it fairly light, just the odd heavier burst around. Temperatures no lower than 5 tonight. That's 41 Fahrenheit. We may still have a lot of cloud and drizzly bits of rain across the south at first tomorrow, but it should clear away by around breakfast time, the rest of the morning dry, and the rest of the day generally dry too. Just one or two bright spells breaking through the odd glimpse of sunshine. Temperatures up to around 11 in the afternoon, that's about 52 Fahrenheit, so feeling reasonably cheerful, I think. The wind's not too strong in from the north and west. A little bit more rain to come perhaps late on Saturday. Apart from that, it's dry. Good night. For a more detailed five-day outlook, call Weather Update, sponsored by Sea France. Travel update in association with Business Pages. Hello, good evening. Ground Force, one of Greece's premier dance companies, is performing at the Riverside Studios tomorrow. Highly visual and intensely dramatic, Medea is their British debut, and the show is said to have the feel of a silent movie. On Saturday, the English Chamber Orchestra is performing the second of their Baroque Plus One concerts. The programme includes pieces from Bach, Fask and Robin Walker. Also on Saturday, the International Flight Training Exhibition. Everything to do with aeroplanes, helicopters, gliding and flying. On to roadworks and the AA warn that the Uxbridge Road at Shepherd's Bush Green is down to one lane, causing delays on all approaches. And major roadworks continue on the North Circular between Hanger Lane and Ealing Common. That's it. Good night. Travel updates with business pages. Helping you to work. I'm ready to go. Into the war zone on Friday nights. Every week we're down there. I like the attention of flights. Friday night fever. You watch that? I always watch that. And Dama and Greg. You're really going to work our hips today. I'm really looking for good dancers and good looking people. When was the last time the sole of your foot touched the back of your head? Friday night on the pool. Hamstring. <laughs> the war zone. Friday night from 10.30 on ITV. Good morning. Good morning. Could I have a box of electricity, please? Economy or family, sir? Economy, please. Imagine a world where electricity wasn't invisible. You'll see the product that we make everywhere. In thousands of workplaces and millions of homes. 100,000 boxes for British Steel. What brand of electricity do you use? Power gen. Our name Power will be a household name. Power gen. Not only here, but abroad. In fact, it would be impossible to imagine life without us. Power Gen. We're the power behind power. Play TV Dreams now and you could be part of a spectacular new TV show. Reveal three stars and you've won a guaranteed £1,000 and a place in the studio audience. And without having to do anything more, you could win the top weekly prize of £100,000. If you find three stars, call us on 0645 100,000. National Lottery Instance TV Dreams. If you're game, we are. She engaged an entire nation and captured the world's attention. She was the symbol of style and earned the respect of the most respected, yet never lost her natural touch. She challenged prejudice and gave a voice to the unheard. Now the remarkable life of this unique woman is documented in Diana, an extraordinary life. A specially created series of BBC films accompanies this complete life study in 26 issues. Diana, in celebration of an extraordinary life.